Would you guys like to see how you construct the best ham and cheese sandwich ever? Okay. It starts with the ham. Yeah. You cook it right up. And then you stick that ham on a bagel. But you do have to melt cheese. Hold on now. Yep. And then you put the bagel itself on. To warm up the bagel. Mmm. Still want it nice and soft though. Mmm. I mean, this is probably borderline illegal. It's a, it might be almost too good. Goodbye. Uh, no, officer. I, uh, I have not been doing anything illegal. <laughs> Take a look at this. Mmm. No, you can't have some! Just kidding. <laughs> so, what I like to do, it is just disgusting windy out there. I planned on making a video out there, but can't do that lately. It's been a long time, too. <laughs> I like to dip it in ranch dressing. Mmm! Is there any better way to do it? No, there isn't. And if you say there is, I probably won't believe you. So let's let's try this out. Oh my goodness. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That's the good stuff! So, how have you guys been? I'm always getting these everything bagels for sandwiches, not the kind that you keep in the refrigerator. Mm. A unicorn just ran by. But you can use these bagels as hamburger buns for a hamburger. Um, yeah. This is the real hamburger here because it's really got ham. The other one is beef. Why do you call it a hamburger when it's beef, man? You got me. But look at that. Oh. My. Goodness! Yes. I hope it focuses. Mmm. Mmm. I've been hearing recently that that it is normally not this windy here for so long in this area. I've been hearing that from the locals. I just happened to get here at a time where it's dry, super dry, and windy all the time, it seems like. Golly. Look at that fake cheese. All melted and wonderfully good makes me sick. So I just made myself a big breakfast. I got butter in between there. Oh yeah. Okay, what do I got here? Yep. Might as well try it. <laughs> See what happens. <laughs> Ooh. It's gonna be the cheesiest. <laughs> Boom, I mixed tuna with it. Looks real good. Oh yeah.
And it is the cheesiest. I didn't even have to use the cheese packet for the craft. All right, folks, so I got a lot of the uh, barbed wire fence done today. Well, I got the bottom. Now I'm gonna microwave the macaroni and cheese from yesterday to go alongside a burger. I'm toasting the bun. I don't have any hamburger buns, so yeah. <laughs> this is disgusting. <laughs> I'm gonna put this on the burger. This is just, this is good stuff. And uh, that will be dinner for tonight. Did quite a bit today. And a lot more to do tomorrow. Hey guys, living on the road full time in my RV can bring me on some pretty crazy adventures. I encourage you to follow along in my adventures on the road. So please subscribe to my channel, share my videos, and thanks for watching. Woo!